from fluffy little otters to some favorite farm animals, here are 10 cute creatures that are actually dangerous. Number 10. Bengal Slow Loris The Bengal Slow Loris is the largest of all the Slow Loris animals. This nocturnal creature has a round head, small ears, and eyes that are simply adorable. How could you ever say no to such a sweet looking creature? Slow lorises live in the trees, they eat mainly fruit and insects, and they are extremely fuzzy. The slow loris is also one of the least studied primates in Asia. I know it kind of looks like a lemur, but it's actually not. And while you may want to cuddle up with this incredibly cute tree dweller, you may want to think again. Cute, but deadly. The Bengal slow loris is just as dangerous as every other species of slow loris. This animal produces a volatile and toxic substance from glands on the insides of its elbows. The slow loris can then lick the substance off the inside of its elbows, which then turns its saliva poisonous. When it bites with poison in its mouth, the slow loris can kill with the toxicity. This is definitely not the kind of animal you want hanging around the house. Nobody wants a pet with poison elbows. Number 9. Otters Okay, come on. Fluffy kittens and sweet little puppies are definitely some of the cutest animals on the planet. But have you ever seen a little otter holding hands or rubbing cheeks? They slide down hills, wrestle each other, and do all sorts of cute otter things. They are simply adorable. It's easy to see why this animal wins our hearts with its good looks and playfulness. But you might not want to try cuddling with this animal. Don't let the cute memes of otters circulating the internet fool you. They are wild and dangerous animals, and can easily inflict horrors on each other and other wildlife. Otters can be found on almost every continent, and there are 13 different species. And these mean facts you're about to get hit with apply to them all. Otters need to eat about a quarter of their body weight daily in order to stay warm, and they will do just about anything to get food, including threatening their own family. Male otters have been observed stealing the babies of the females and holding them underwater till the female brings them food. They will also violently steal food from each other. There are multiple documented cases of otters lashing out aggressively. In New York at the Bronx Zoo, a monkey sat next to a pond filled with otters. There is a video of the innocent little monkey falling into the water and was then getting attacked by the otters. Another incident at a zoo in England reported a tamarin escaped its enclosure, fell into the otters exhibit, and then was eaten by not-so-innocent otters. The giant otter of the Amazon has an average weight of 75 pounds and can be more than 6 feet. They have a terrible reputation of capsizing canoes. Otters are the perfect example of cute but dangerous. Number 8. Cows Prepare to be shocked. Many of us see cows on a regular basis. If you live in the country, you'll probably see cows all the time on your daily commute. And while cows are cute and innocent, often lounging around all day in the field and not bothering anybody, this is actually a ruse. Believe it or not, cows can kill. Killer cows! Yes, I know! Here's the story. The best example of this is a recent story reported by the BBC in which a family was attacked by cows while walking in the United Kingdom. A man named Mark had been walking with his 82-year-old mother and some friends when they were ambushed by cows in Cumbria. So far as the story goes, the group saw the cows drinking from a nearby stream and the walkers had to cross over the stream. They really didn't think anything of it. They started walking, then the cows turned around and attacked their dog. It became an absolute frenzy. The dog was trampled to death by the cows, and then the cows went after the man's senior mother, knocking her to the ground. She ended up suffering a broken arm from the attack. At the end, everyone got away alive except for the dog, as luckily some of the walkers fought back against the cows with their walking sticks. Mark said he supported farmers, but believes there should be a law ordering them to put up signs for nursing cattle. Number 7. Prairie Dogs Let's take a look at prairie dogs, which aren't actually canines or related to dogs at all. These tiny little animals are pretty adorable looking, and they are absolutely no harm to humans, but they are indeed dangerous to other animals. In fact, a new study has shown that the white-tailed prairie dog, which live mostly in Utah, Colorado, and Wyoming, are killing machines. These disgruntled herbivores have been caught red-handed murdering squirrels for apparently no reason. The prairie dogs have been caught biting squirrels, shaking them to death, and then just leaving their dead bodies in the dirt. They seem to be doing this unprovoked, for no reason, but probably with a lot of malice. A researcher and his team at the Arapaho National Wildlife Refuge have so far documented prairie dogs killing over 100 ground squirrels in the last five years. Not only that, but there are 62 suspected killings that prairie dogs were likely involved in. In the time studying this phenomenon, 
The researchers recorded at least 43 adult prairie dogs, both male and female, participating in the act of murder. In one particularly violent event, researchers witnessed a single prairie dog dig seven squirrel babies out of different dens and kill them unprovoked for no reason. If that's not a dangerous animal, I don't know what is. Number 6. Panda Bear Pandas are a lot of people's favourite animals. It's pretty easy to see why. With their distinctive white coat and black around their eyes, legs and shoulders, they're extremely cute. They have a reputation of being harmless with a charming habit of sneezing. They spend most of their time sleeping or eating bamboo. While it's undeniable that pandas are striking animals, the reality is those teeth aren't just for crunching bamboo. They will use them for protection against predators like snow leopards and jackals. They're pretty docile around humans, but if provoked, they can become extremely aggressive and it would undoubtedly be a mistake to get too close to one in the wild. Pandas are used to being adored by humans when in captivity, but they can be extremely dangerous. In 2006, a drunk and not so bright 28 year old man named Zhang climbed into the panda enclosure at Beijing Zoo to pet the bear. He wanted to show off to his companion, but all he had to show for his brandished display of stupidity was a right calf savaged beyond recognition. Oh, and the panda's bite force is among the highest. Number 5. Dolphins Everyone loves dolphins. They're majestic creatures that are all fun and games and cute to swim with on vacation in Mexico. They are highly social and incredibly clever, and usually seen as friendly animals that love to play and jump through the waves near passing boats. But they also have an evil streak most don't know about until you find out they are secret murderers. Scientists followed a bloody trail of evidence that proves that dolphins aren't exactly the happy creatures humans think they are. Growing evidence shows that 12 foot are killing fellow mammals with their sharp teeth and using their beaks as clubs to bludgeon porpoises by the hundreds. They do this just for the fun of it. They've even been seen murdering their young. Off the coast of Scotland, a researcher watched in disbelief for an hour as an adult dolphin picked up a baby in its mouth and banged it against the water over and over until it sank from view below the water. If they are capable of doing something so horrifying to their own young, imagine what they could do to a human. Experts believe that many tourist attractions will continue until a major incident occurs. Number 4. Honey Badger the honey badger is one of the toughest and most dangerous animals in the animal kingdom. It's also ridiculously adorable. It looks like an evil skunk. Even just looking at the honey badger's face, you can tell it's up to something bad. In terms of being attacked by a honey badger, don't worry too much, it's probably not going to happen. But for any other animal, the honey badger is a menace. These things are highly resistant to the venom from snakes and scorpions. They have a tail that measures 9 inches and can be used as a weapon. They also have a unique two-tone coat that covers their skin and helps them to survive. Plus, the honey badger can endure the bites from just about anything. And they also bite back. Honey badgers can dig, they can fight, and they have pretty much no fear at all. In the Guinness Book of World Records, the honey badger has the title of world's most fearless creature. What other animal will eat poisonous insects, venomous snakes, and even stand up to lions, leopards, and hyenas? They're sort of lazy animals that don't really find the energy to make a home for themselves, but have no problem making themselves comfortable in another creature's residence. It's no wonder that honey badgers have been the subject of memes and internet fame related to their notorious ill-tempered nature. They don't care. They will fight anyone and everyone. Number 3. Hippopotamus Hippos are incredibly cute animals that resemble floating potatoes. Oftentimes you just see their cute little faces sticking out of the water. But don't get it twisted. It doesn't matter how cute they appear to be, they are one of the deadliest animals on land and in water. According to reports, some say they are actually the most dangerous in Africa, more so than lions, snakes and hyenas. They are so aggressive, even crocodiles are afraid of them. They average 3,500 to 4,500 pounds, they probably weigh more than your car, and they can be heavier than that. It's estimated they kill around 3,000 people every year. One of the worst cases recorded in the history of hippos ambushing humans was in 2014. Twelve children and an adult perished when a hippopotamus overturned a boat near Niger's capital, Niame. Hippos are the tank of the animal kingdom, and their strength should never be underestimated. In 2014, a single giant hippo took on a pride of lions when they made the mistake of trying to have the hippo for dinner. They tend to yawn a lot, which most people believe it means the hippo is relaxed and content. But according to a conservation ecologist, Johan Eckstein, who has studied hippos for 30 years in South Africa, this actually means they are agitated and probably about to strike. Especially if you hear them laughing. So yes, hippos are undeniably adorable looking, but I highly suggest not getting too close. 
Number two, owls. Owls are insanely loved creatures. You can't even walk into a store without finding some kind of piece of furniture or decoration with an owl on it, whether it's a clock, a throw pillow, or even just a little statue. And while some people are wildly obsessed with owls, everyone should know that these cute birds are actually violent predators that are dangerous to humans. Owls have actually been known to attack people, seemingly unprovoked. It's highly unlikely you would ever die from being attacked by an owl, but it definitely happens. In one story reported by the San Juan Journal, a man was minding his own business while he jogged up a hill in his residential neighborhood, when out of the darkness, an owl swooped. He felt razor-sharp knives against his head, his hat was ripped away, and then it was all over in the sound of feathers. This particular man did not die, and he wasn't gravely injured, but the fact that he was attacked randomly by a malevolent owl just goes to show that these unique and attractive birds can cause harm, and you should watch out. Also, in the docuseries The Staircase, a man accused of murdering his wife by pushing her down the stairs, Michael Peterson, pled that it wasn't him. He claims it was an owl that actually got through an open door in the house, which sat in a heavily wooded area, swooped down upon her and knocked her down the stairs. I don't know about that, but it's definitely suspect. Number 1. Horse Forget all about snakes and spiders. The most dangerous animal in Australia is actually the horse. According to a new study by the Melbourne University, researchers have discovered that more Australians have been killed by horses in the last few years than by any of the venomous creatures in the country. Between 2000 and 2013, snake bites killed 27 people, ticks and ants killed 5 people, box jellyfish killed 3 people, spiders actually killed 0 people, but a whopping 74 Australians were trampled to death by a horse. How's that for statistics? The horse, one of the most beautiful and beloved animals of all time, except for maybe dogs, is actually a bloodthirsty beast trampling Australians to death. No one would have expected that, especially in a country as full of dangerous wildlife as Australia. Are any of these dangerous animals a surprise to you? Let me know your thoughts in the comments. Thanks for watching, and be sure to come back soon for more fun videos. If you haven't already, don't forget to subscribe. See you next time.